thanks for the time this afternoon. And Kirby, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself to all of our viewers? Sure. Hi, Kirby Green, top producer, account manager. Uh, so KDI and, and others, all of our all of our listeners and viewers. Um, I live in Kentucky. Um, I work across uh, the northeastern U.S. working with 35 farms that are in our top producer network. My background here at the company, um, I was a FSR for DeKalb Asgro. I've been with the company, get this, almost 10 years. So that makes me feel older and older, Katie. Um, but it's a privilege to be not only plugged in with the top producer network, but also, as you know, um, just to be working in agriculture with some excellent farmers. So thanks for having me. Well, thanks for taking the time out of your your crazy world, right? Not only here at Maircraft Science, but you know, you're a mother of three and you've got lots of other things on your plate and you are the host of Sharpen, a wonderful podcast for those that have not taken a listen yet, but kind of walk us through how that started and what are some learnings from that? Sure. So uh, it was, um, gosh, it was January of 2017. Katie and um, I, re I, I got the idea of the podcast. Um, uh, I was, I just had my second daughter, and um, my my friends teased me that I was looking at LinkedIn at like two in the morning, right? As I'm being here, they're like, "Who's on LinkedIn at two in the morning?" I'm like, "This is who I am. I enjoy reading a uh, couple of articles there." But it said on the on the um, clickbait, the number one mistake women make in their thirties. And so I was like, oh, it's, it's clickbait, but I'm still going to click it and find out. And I think it could be true for for anybody. I, at the time, I, I wasn't 30. I was almost going to be 30. But it talked about how this number one mistake was that they stopped networking because there might be a certain level of comfort in a role or at a company or just not having the time, right? They're going back and master's programs or moving to a new city or, you know, in my case, maybe the addition of a family member, maybe it's the addition of a pet, uh, but a lot of life changes. And so that that resonated with me. And I also knew that we were in this new era of a new way to connect digitally like we had never had before. And so this idea of the podcast came about, um, but specifically for young professionals that were in the first 10 years of a career. So, you know, being on the road between meetings, if you're not maybe taking a phone call from a customer, I don't know about you, but I love to listen to podcasts. And there are some excellent ones out there, but I remember the listening to several of them and thinking, this content feels like it's for someone that has been in the workplace for 30 years, right? I wanted that, that young professional's um, color and flavor to the conversation. And so I thought, what? well, why not me, right? Why not start that conversation? And what was crazy, Katie, is that over the course of um, a year, I started out, you know, with, uh, I would look at, I don't anymore, but I used to look at like, where are these people that are listening and how many people? And I remember the first episode launched and there were like 350 downloads, uh, which was crazy to me. And so many of those people were uh, FFA friends, friends from college, the list goes on. But what began to happen was people I'd never met would reach out after listening to an episode to share learning. And so over the course of um, its existence, there's been over 10,000 downloads is, is kind of the the regular now globally. Um, so it's it's just been so cool to be a part of. And, and for me and for Sharpen, the neat thing that I think about that is uh, such a unique aspect of the world we live in is, I, you know, I bought a $50 microphone and recorded some conversations um, that were about 20 to 30 minutes in length. So nothing was, was, um, was really, uh, you know, that, that crazy. I think back in the olden days, you would have to have like a, a studio and to be on radio, right? The, the level, the cost of entry was just so intense. And today we live in a world where we just have so many abilities to engage digitally. And so that was, that was such a learning as well, um, is do, and, and, and I'll tell you, Katie, too, I'll listen to those beginning episodes and I'll sometimes like, oh gosh, that was terrible. I think the biggest takeaway for me is not only did it address a problem that more young professionals wanted the content, not only that it did it teach me like, holy cow, we have this ability to engage digitally we never have before and reach people and, and connect with people, 
I think the biggest thing was, and I'm, I'm doing more talking than I am used to, right? Being on the other side of this with you right now, but it was sitting down and, and thinking of better, more thoughtful questions and listening, right? That was my role. And so outside of the podcast, whether it is as a, um, a sales representative, whether it's as a mother, as a spouse, as a friend, like it taught me a new skill set and I hopefully am getting better and better with each episode. So I've actually taken a little bit of a, of a pause because I'm now at that tail end of the young professionals group. So I'm, I'm old is what I'm trying to say. So I'm in this stage now of evaluating what are the next steps and kind of what's the direction kind of keeping with the theme though of sharpen. Um, so as iron sharpens iron, so one man, one person sharpens another is kind of the premise of it. No, I think that's great. And I know listening to your podcast has made me think about, you know, such as this YouTube page, right? How can I be, how can I bring the same communication and maybe a little different format? Cause I'm with you. We spend time driving, right? And I just enjoy to learn in a little bit different way than always reading a book, right? Or always reading an article. So that's awesome, Kirby. And we just really want to wrap up and say thank you for your time and thanks for thinking outside the box and remind us again of the podcast. So if folks want to take a listen. Yeah. So I think it's 65 episodes in it's sharpen the podcast for young professionals. You can find it anywhere where you listen to podcasts. And um, there have also been some alumni from our, our Bayer world um, that joined for some episodes. So that's fun as well as some other people that um, it'd be really neat to meet and hear their story. Awesome. Well, thanks for uh, being innovative and going digital and doing that. And everyone else, take a look. So Kirby, we'll say thank you for your time. And everyone, have a great day.